morning everybody this is Liek McGillivray I'm having a coffee and some fun I was um, doing some troubleshooting with a cover because the signatures were so bulky that I couldn't close it up right the right way you see they're so thick already so I did some troubleshooting first I thought I, I'll take it apart and I'll start again but the decorations and all I wanted to keep it so what I did was I expanded the sides the overlap I made an overlap here okay can you see it yes I made an overlap here so I glued on on this piece I glued a double folded uh, piece of paper of 30 by 30 centimeter the the pack uh, 12 by 12 inch and I also did it here a little bit smaller I took some um, wallpaper and a piece of the Klimt pack and also here the same extra wallpaper and now it's like this so I have a fold over so <clears throat> that's one thing I can put the signatures in And then I'm going to do a flip through. Oh, <laughs> you see, this is silk. I'm spinning wool and silk. Green wool, three kinds of green. Shades of green. And uh, three shades of silk, maybe four or five, I don't know. Um, let's see if I can get it right in focus I made a little can you see it a little uh, key and a cloisonnier bead on the dangle for the elastic bands and here I did a little angel and I've shown it before how to make it an angel and a little butterfly So, I'm mm, going to do it this way, put the signatures in, find the middle, and the next. First I took some papers out and then I said, oh, that's so, I was so sorry to take them out because I love them all. I love you all, but this way it's, it's okay to, okay, close it up like this, like this. And this goes over. Put them a bit in place. Oh, this is that's why it's strange like this. So that's all right. Just gives you a rich feeling. I have done some scores here, so it will go round a little. So it's expandable. And here is the elastic band that goes over it. So you can take that off and put it aside. It won't be in the way when you're working. 
So there it is. A nice big journal for somebody to play with. I've left enough room. But yes, I like it. I like the dangles. I put on some of my own papers. I'm already working for some own for my own digitals. In the past I've been making some designs uh, for fabrics. I even printed them with stamps my own fabrics. So I think I can do that on paper too. And uh, my head is buzzing with ideas. So when this puppy is up, I'm gonna work too bad. So maybe you're gonna have to wait a little for me. I don't know. So have the flip through. This is the inside of one. You can see it all matches. A little booklet with some um, ledger, lots of space to put things in of your own, little thoughts you have. So let's see how I can do this. Good. Give it some room. Are we still in? Like this. Yes. Well. Here it was, your, the last thing I made, the little, and I made special pockets for it, so if you put it in, the bead is, well, isn't it nice, with the, the foil press from, what was it, spell binders? I've decorated with the clean papers, the, the little squares I put in half and I uh, decorated it with the liner, the, the liner paint from Stamperia. I love it very much. I hope they make new ones with more colors because it's so nice. So, this is the way you open it up. I haven't shown it like this, but this is the way you open it up. It folds out like this. And I love this. I'm, I bet I'm gonna make some more because it will be nice as a, as a gift envelope. Oh, I have to glue that again. I'm going to do that later. Um, you can put some money here or a gift card. You can put a sewing for traveling. A sewing, what is it? Uh, how do you call it? A travel pocket for your sewings. I'm going to put it aside to save time. So... Nice papers. This paper is from um, Paulette Slater from TLC Creations. And I think it goes wonderful with it. When I saw it, I thought, yes, I need this. I made the belly bands and the cards. You see the Samparia colors. They fit. Uh, this is also a piece of uh, Paulette Slater. And I used a black liner paint to... Uh, take some details. Um, these are from the Junk Journal Studio. The second um, labels of the past, the latest. This also, Paulette Slater, Junk Journal Studio. Paulette Slater. Mm, a card of the I printed ledger on the back. This is packaging paper I saved. Um, 
Yeah, I folded two pockets. And I did a fold over because the um, the papers of uh, Sampalia are so nice. I can't choose. So I thought of ways to use them, but that you didn't have to uh, choose between the one side or the other. So that is this, and that is why I made the belly band sliders. Another one. So nice pockets, TLC creations. So the ones that you see with the the designs, the designs are from TLC. The other than other than the Stamperia Klimt. This is my. Um, Fold over envelope I made. Nice decorated. Mm. A piece of paper. And here you have also something you can write on or do little pictures, souvenirs. Uh, I thought maybe I didn't uh, want to glue it or something like that, but here's more space to. Put your private thoughts or your photographs, your secret lover or your secret crush <laughs> you can dwell on. So, nice paper clips. Um, yesterday I got in some, some things from my wholesaler. I ran out of these, almost ran out of these nice envelopes, the damast envelopes. But I found gold envelopes and I have put them through um, a folder, um, an embossing folder. So this is also very nice to use. <laughs> you can hardly find a... And I think it's also nice for ripping up and put on. Yes, I love them. So, totally in love. With the gold. This is uh, the huge paper clip. The whole book, most of it, is uh, on a playlist. So if you want to make something like this, just look at the playlist. This is a, a um, giant hidden paper clip. It's also on the playlist. Some cards, some decoration. Labels from the past. And I like things like this. To keep the pages open for somebody to work with. I made a golden. And yeah. I clean it up. But you need alcohol wipes for that. And I, I bound it with just a golden. Uh. What's it called? Lint? <laughs> I, I forgot the word. But a golden ribbon like this. So it's simple, but I like it. And maybe I'm gonna decorate it with an uh, envelope because this is so contagious. I don't know how you call it in uh, English, but it gets smudged very easily. The back here I made an envelope. I got a foiling uh, machine, hot foiling machine, and I went to town with it. Uh, this is uh, a part of my own print, some stamping I did, and uh, I do the the tree of life with um, with the liner, the paint liner, liner paint. So, if your stamping is not that didn't work out that well, you can also take the liner. It comes also in black. So, have some art fun. So, here you can do a little writing or some photos.
I was thinking, did I put push the button? But I think I did. <laughs> Here's my belly band slider. And this one I also designed to uh, use the papers without losing much of the design. So if you take another piece of paper, you can glue it on like this. One, uh, one side, fold it over and fold it that this is... Uh, a little bit on the inside and you can see also the paper from the back put some cards in so this is a nice way to use your papers you don't have to choose this is just I had some fun with some mosaic in the colors and this is a uh, a digital I bought from uh, from the real uh, Klimt paper paintings and I took some fragments and I blew them up. I like to do that with my own photographs or designs too. Uh, this is just an, a card, a journaling card with some cards in it. So lots of space for the one who gets it to go to town itself. Another journaling card. I designed these tabs, wheel tail tabs, because they're called wheel tail tabs. <laughs> and I thought, why not make real wheel tails for a tab? So this one I didn't show. I think I didn't make it, but it's so simple. Just two strips of paper uh, and two other strips of paper. Fold these over because these are longer than these one. And an, a piece of paper that's folded over it and glued here so you can open it up. Put some pictures here, some writing, whatever you want. Some pieces to also journal in. And it's just, I call it a hangover. So, and I don't know why I do. I must have more space to put it on, but for now it's okay. So, you can have... You can put it over and fold it over and there's still room left for the person who gets it to to play. This is another oh, I took two. envelope. The same idea. I think this one was somewhere else. I don't know where, but and, and this is also the other side of the folded. So I took one paper, I glued a paper on the back, and then I took two papers and folded the ones inside and the ones uh, di diagonal. Some cards. Also, uh, this is the this is the prints, the digitals I bought. And I, uh, this one I only did with the liner paint. And this one I did with uh, my own mate's uh, watercolor paint and some liner. So more shiny effects. And it happened so that I had the, the German Journal uh, Studio, the labels from the past, part two, I think they're called. And the colors matched, so there you have it. I don't know where to put this one. <laughs> and here is uh, another belly band slider with some cards in it. And this is the last, oh, also a pocket with something I made way earlier and I found and I thought, okay. 
that color is right here and another car is uh, this is also for the di from the digitals I bought so and I collaged it with some of my own paper this is the back of the first part this is um, a dress I, I have made many many years ago I think 20, 20 years ago I started as a designer for clothes I didn't finish that study because I thought no this is not my uh, world to live in it was too much because I am super sensitive and well it was just was too much for me I clammed up so but I still make things I still design for myself and for my mother sometimes for others I love for people I love but I got the dress and I always loved Klimt so when I had this dress and I had a picture of myself and then I went to town I don't know if the painting is here and I think it's not here so I can't show you but uh, these are pieces of paper I cut out these also just uh, this was whole 3d and I think I'm gonna do some more on this with that paint now I'm watching it for the second time third time maybe because that effect has gone but if you take these this 3d uh, this uh, paint liner I think it will be more awesome so this is part one closing that up and this is part two again that envelope origami envelope it's on the playlist give it a try maybe you need some practice but if you worked it out oh you're gonna love it I'm sure I love it I've seen more of these but not with a with a decoration like this and the, and the bead like that to pull it in and out this is so nice to do so this envelope I made uh, the other one was, was a bit small so I made uh, envelopes that were a bit higher. So that makes the whole thing also more bulkier. But well, this one I had, I made it in a belly band with a golden foil. And there's two types of gold, the matte and the shiny. Same belly bands, same piece of paper. Uh, a piece of paper and a junk journal studio colette's paper ledger of my own so another pocket with cards from the junk journal studio a nice pocket journal for journaling and I didn't do the same with the folding I just took the um, 12 by 12 inch black paper and I glued it on and I folded it in and this is a little notebook I made to go in oh, and isn't it pretty from Paulette Slater, the butterflies, uh, another envelope like that with something to play. I just glued this on. It's a pocket, but a secret pocket if you want to. So, oh, let's another belly band slider. And you see, you don't have to waste 
one side of the designs like this. And I love this paper. But you can also emboss yourself if you like you have seen. No more hoarding for me. <laughs> the papers. So another big um how you call it? Hidden paper clip with pockets. Oh, and here also a um, little piece to journal on. Maybe I'm gonna put some paper in here too. But it was already so bulky. <laughs> uh, another pocket. Uh, craft paper. This is some paper I found also many years ago. So I'm gonna use everything up. Little tickets, labels from the past, TLC creations, and this is all one pack. Another little. notebook yes I'm gonna do some lining here so maybe tomorrow or next week I'm gonna put put a little piece on where I do just that another card little card so also like this the card is I just glued this bit and it's a pocket so here you can put things on and you still have the design from the back also. If you glue it like that. This is the same. Also glued just here. Here's a pocket. So pockets in the pockets. And the cards. Lovely. So, this is the same way, a card, journaling card, with, did I glue it? No, <laughs> journaling card. And I love these golden paper clips. The big ones, I almost ran out of it, but, and I don't know where I put it now, I found out that with alcohol ink, you can color anything silver, gold, so, did I, yeah, I already shown this one, and another fold over, or a hangover, oh. This is not the way it's supposed to be. So, space to journal. And I'm gonna need that. I'm gonna glue that paper down. And here is another journaling card with the wheel tail tap. So more papers, another envelope, so you can, I think I glued this one, I don't know why, <laughs> and I thought to make it a pocket, but, well, it's a mystery, so I think I'm, leave it like this, but, Let's put this one here then. So, I'm gonna put something over here so it is a pocket. Um, 
always good to do a flip through. And then you can see where you miss the boat a little. Nice pockets. This is also from that package from uh, TLC Creations. I didn't use all, so but you're gonna see more of that. A little card with a tuck spot, and journaling space. So this is again. I took a piece of uh, 12 by 12 inch, 30 by 30 centimeters almost, and I just glued it on and folded over and made it into a pocket. This is another card that goes well with it. And another belly band, the slider, and some cards here also. I made those booklets with the papers. And another of this one. So you can write and put it away. And you don't have to choose between the de the designs. So that's nice. So another piece of paper and a piece of the Klimt paper. And this is the 8x8 paper, I thought. Yes. I don't, I'm not sure. Well, which paper is this? 6x6? Six 6x6 six? Six six is this. And that's it. The last page, this is a uh, gold parchment paper, and I glued it with uh, normal glue will warp, but I glued it with a double sided tape, so that's okay. I think that's okay. And another. Oh, I did not show the other one, I think. Ledger. This is Mr. H. Angel. And that's my name. So, it was nice to have found that ledger. So I always can have a <laughs> ledger with my name up. I took uh, some uh, washi tape. And then put it on the sewing machine so that's also a nice texture interesting texture as well so that's it close it up so I still have some things I have to do I found out to make it better, I'm gonna do that. And if anyone is interested, this is for sale. So I have to. Think about the price. But you see, it's a big one. Lots of paper, lots of work, but I'm not gonna ask for more than a hundred euros because I've seen prices that are so ridiculous. And I just would like someone to be happy. I can't use them all. I just want someone to be happy with with the thing I made. So that's it for today. If you have any questions, ask. I also like the nice comments you gave me until now, so keep on that. Keep on watching. And please like and subscribe if you want to see some more. I like to get in contact with you. If you want to know anything, or tell, tell me again, or show me again, or something you didn't see, or find. 
but most of it is in the playlist so watch that thumbs up subscribe and like thank you for watching bye